Now, we will consider the last uh, set of two port parameters which are known as G parameters or inverse hybrid parameters. In case of hybrid or H parameters, we took I 1 and V 2 as independent variables. Now, in this case, we will take V 1 and I 2 as independent variables. Okay. Otherwise, the rest of the stuff is similar to uh, H parameters and also to Z and Y in that you set one of the parameters to 0 for the measurement and so on. Okay. So, we apply V 1 and I 2 and measure I 1 and V 2. As you expect, both I 1 and V 2 are linear combination of the applied independent sources, which are V 1 and I 2. Okay. Now, to measure this, again we will do four measurements with uh, independent, some independent source set to 0 each time. First, we set I 2 to 0, which means that we open circuit port 2 okay, and apply a voltage V 1 to port 1 and then we measure I 1 and V 2. Okay. So, I 1 will turn out to be G 1 1 times V 1, the contribution from I 2 is 0, because I 2 itself is 0. So, this tells you that G 1 1 is I 1 by V 1 with port 2 open circuited okay. and you can see that G 1 1 is nothing but the conductance looking into port 1 with port 2 open circuited. Okay. Now, V 2 will be G 2 1 V 1. So, G 2 1 will be nothing but V 2 by V 1 with port 2 open circuited. So, this G 2 1 is nothing but the voltage gain from port 1 to port 2 with port 2 open circuited. Okay. So, very similar to whatever we had earlier and naturally G 1 1 has dimensions of conductance and G 2 1 is dimensionless. Okay. Now, for the other set of measurements, we set V 1 to 0. So, that is port 1 short circuited and we apply a current I 2 to port 2. With that, we measure I 1 and V 2. Okay. So, in this case, I 1 will be G 1 2 times I 2 
or G 1 2 is I 1 by I 2 with port 1 shorted. In other words, it is the current gain from port 2 to port 1 with port 1 shorted okay. and V 2 is G 2 2 times I 2 or G 2 2 is V 2 by I 2 with V 1 equal to 0 which is nothing but the resistance looking into port 2 with port 1 shorted. Okay. So, that is what G 2 2 is. So, very very similar to uh, all the other parameters the measurement techniques are. Now, the G parameter matrix is G 1 1 G 1 2, G 2 1, G 2 2, where these two are dimension less and this one is a conductance and that one is a resistance. And from the definitions, it must be obvious that this is the inverse of the H parameter matrix. Z and Y are inverses of each other and G and H are inverses of each other. Okay?